What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Mike Rich, man. What's happening today? Um, I got the same shirt on. I'm doing two videos today. So, just let y'all know, so I don't get the trolls going to comment. Dang, Rich, how many times you gonna wear that black on black Atlanta Falcon shirt, dog? What's going on with you? You don't ran out of shirts? Is it laundry day, Rich? What's happening? Nah, that's, that's my impression of a troll. Well, you know, <laughs> anyway, man, today, um, I just, I did a Kobe uh, review, and I'm also going to do a review of the Air Jordan 4s, man. Some 4 action. You already know some J's got to be in the uh, in the agenda for the day. But anyway, the official name on these boys is Air Jordan 4 Retro, of course. And official colorway is black, uh, I mean white, black, and gem red. And they retail for 190 Focus. Focus. Dollars. So uh, today, um, I just want to do some retro action going on. I uh, appreciate everybody who looked at my vlog. Um, I did with Tony D to pick these up. Tony D too wild. Y'all make sure y'all y'all already not doing it, which you probably are. Go check out his channel, man. Subscribe to him. I would appreciate that. Um, and check out his his vlog as well. So um, we had a good time, man. That dude, he's real good, down to earth, humble cat, man. Like he he's, he's cool, man. I didn't realize. That he was gonna be that cool man. I mean, we, we met and we like clicked right away, man. We were going back and forth, man. And it, it was just dope, man. So uh shout out to Tony D2 Wild, man. Also shout out to Bull, man. Shout out to all y'all boys, all the YouTube, all my fellow YouTubers. I would like to send a shout out to y'all, man. But anyway, let's go ahead and get into the sneaker. Let's do it, man. And, and bow! Yes, sir. Uh, the Air Jordan 4. Alternate 89 joints, man. Yes, sir. These right here. <clears throat> wow. These right here are cleansed. So let's go ahead and get into the review. Let's tuck that tag in, man. The upper. Okay. Now this is different. I want to do a slight comparison. I wore these yesterday. Give me a sec. Pull these out. Pull these yesterday when I did the pickup vlog. The um the um legend blue fours right here. The only difference, the only thing I like about this shoe that I don't like on this shoe. I like now I like the fact that they got the knit and that just give you that good retro look. But this shoe and the paint is pretty similar too. But this shoe has tumbled leather around the entire shoe, around the toe cap, around the side panels, on the back. Everything is tumbled leather leather on this shoe, even the tongue. I understand, even with a lot of the OG fours like this. It don't have tumble leather around the old shoe, the whole shoe. But seeing this, this is really not an OG sneaker. I would like it so much if this toe cap was leather. I mean, uh, tumble leather. Now, it's not a bad grain of leather. I don't know if you can really tell. Let me see. Let me get behind the camera so I can make sure I'm showing this, showing y'all the sneaker right. Wait a minute. See, now that it ain't even bright enough for him. My bad, y'all. I just did this on the Kobe video too, had <laughs> to make it a little bit brighter. But um, around the toe cap, you got it's a decent leather. It's kind of slightly green, but it's not a um, it's not a tumble. I just love the look of a tumble leather, and I wish they would. You can see the difference real good right there. I wish they would have put a tumble on the entire sneaker. That would have been super dope in my opinion. But um, with, other than that, man, the shoe is clean. Like the paint on this thing, the paint on it is like immaculate. It's just like the Columbia Fours. The paint is so clean. It got that gloss on it. People want to complain about it being too shiny. I don't think that's a problem. I think as long as the paint is clean and flawless. And my pair, I don't have any flaws. I had one pair that I, that I seen at the store and I didn't buy it because it had like a little stain on it. If y'all saw my review, <laughs> y'all know how crazy that was. But um, okay. But anyway, you got your red going across the midsole, white going across the uh, toe cap. You got your um, your your white upper with your um red netting, your red uh, waffles up here at the top. Um. Then you got the tongue is like almost exactly like the uh, fire red fours, the flight patch with the um, black jump man, and you also got a black jump man on the heel of the shoe. Which all like I said, all of this is tumbled leather on the other um, on the Columbia fours. Then you got your alternate eighty nine right here, which I'm thinking is just this. This would have been like a PE or alternate shoe that Jordan would have wore um, opposite the fire red fours like back in the day of PEs actually existed. So it's not an OG colorway, but it's a very nice and clean colorway. Um, in my opinion, but um, you got your bottoms with the red and the black on the um, in the front right here. Of course, you got your upside down Air Jordan behind the tongue. Um, white lace action. 
But that's pretty much it on these. It's a simple shoe. It don't take a whole lot of um going crazy on the review. I'm glad they didn't make this um this strap part right here, this plastic part. I'm glad they didn't make that black or red. I'm glad they kept it white because it kept that simple look that the shoe has and it makes it a very wearable shoe. Um in my humble opinion. But anyway, man, that's been, I, that's my quick my quick little review on these, man. The Air Jordan 4 alternate 89 joints, aka Candy Cane action. That's what I call them. Candy Cane. Y'all seen that movie uh Joyride? Candy Cane. The uh, truck driver, his name was Candy Cane. <laughs> his name wasn't Candy Cane. The dude was acting like he was a girl and he was calling himself Candy Cane. And he was messing with the truck driver. Anyway, if y'all it's a horror movie, y'all want to see, y'all go check Joyride out. I thought that was a pretty good movie. Um, but anyway, candy cane joints, man. Let's call them joy rides. Uh, anyway, I know y'all want to see these on feet, man. So let me let y'all go on ahead and check these out. What y'all think? Oh, um, feet, man. I'm gonna start off with the um, camo joggers. I haven't, I haven't worn these joggers since uh, sneaker con, sneaker con. Um, they're a little bit bigger than I would like. I have to keep pulling them up, but uh, I think they look dope with these. I thought the color, the camo, would hit nicely off the red and white. In my, y'all already know what it is. Y'all can finish that. <laughs> but yeah, man, the camo joggers. Get a little booty going on. A little ass action. Booty. <laughs> yes, sir, yes, sir. Uh, uh, so, um, you don't know. Y'all comment below, man. I think this is a dope shoe. Come below, tell me if y'all like these. If not, you know, gotta take that tag off. <laughs> but uh, that's it, man. That's these. Yeah, give y'all a look at what they look like with some jeans. I don't do much jean action, so check out some jean action. Just jeans look. Clean shoe. I'm gonna take this tag off. I don't keep this on. I just I just keep everything on until I'm really wear them, ready to wear them out. But uh, you're a man. Cleansed. You already know. Cleansed in my opinion. You already know what it is. Uh, comment below. Tell me what y'all think about this on feet on these. Walk by action. Yeah. So, um, yes, sir. Uh, cleansed. I love the flight. I love the flight uh, tag on these. I love that. Just OG, had that OG retro look to me. But that's these, man. There's those. On feet action. Yes, sir. So uh, I appreciate y'all for watching this video. It's been your boy, Mike Rich, man. Y'all hit that thumbs up, like, subscribe, and all that good stuff. And keep watching them, because that's what I'm here for. Gone.